So today we're gonna do another exercise with uh, derivatives with uh, parameters. Yes, we have here the function uh, k where the variable is x, and we have uh, this sum. So the first rule is that uh, the derivative in the variable x of uh, a function which is a sum, the derivative of the sum is the sum of the derivatives. So we can write it as in this way. First derivative, now we have a second rule, which is when we have uh, uh, x to the power of n, the derivative is going to be n, uh, x to the power of n minus 1. So the derivative is lowering of the power of x to 1 less. Mm -hmm. So applying this rule here, we have 2 where a, which is a constant, so it goes out of the derivative, where the derivative, uh, yes, for x. Yes, plus. Plus. Here we have b, where the derivative of x in the variable x, which is 1, so 1 multiplied by b is b. Then we have the derivative of a constant, and the derivative of a constant is always zero, so it might be zero, like, like a zero, <laughs> plus this we can actually write as the derivative from the variable x of the constant d that multiplies 1 over e divided by x, but on divided by x we can write the x to the power of minus 1. And this is going to be the derivative to the variable x of the function k in the variable x of 2ax plus b plus d multiplied by minus 1 per x to the power of minus 1 minus 1, which is minus 2. Mm -hmm. So, in the end, the result, we can directly do that this is equal to 2ax plus b minus d divided by x to the power of 2. Mm -hmm. That's it. Just, uh, okay. So, we have the, here 2ax because 2 comes in the front and this uh, according to this rule goes 2 minus 1 and it's gonna be 1 here right 